Hey guys, Leif here from uh, ATEC Office Technology. Today I'd like to give you a, a demonstration on how to use AirPrint on the new Brother multifunction devices. So Brother now supports AirPrint on pretty much all of their devices, all inkjet and laser devices pretty much. And uh, if you're not sure if your printer supports uh, AirPrint, just have a look at the Brother website and you'll see whether it's uh, listed there. And uh, a couple of things you need to do to get started uh, setting up uh, AirPrint. Uh, on this one, this one is the uh, Brother MFC 9330, that just recently have been uh, uh, announced to the market. Uh, when you unpack it and you set it up, just follow the instructions to connect this one to your local Wi-Fi. So you have to have a local Wi-Fi already in, uh, uh, in range. Set up the printer to connect to that and make sure you have your iPhone also connected to the same Wi-Fi. And once that's done, you're basically ready to go with AirPrint from your iPod or iPhone or iPad. So if you come a bit closer now, I'm gonna show you how, to, uh, how this works. So pretty much, uh, uh, maybe not all applications, but most applications now support AirPrint. So whether it's your photos or any of the pages uh, or notes or you name it, uh, you open it and it will support uh, AirPrint. I'm just going to go into my notes in this example. Uh, I'm going to pick up one of my notes and uh, once you've got the document or the photo or whatever it is that you print, once you've got it ready, it would usually have a little button down at the left hand corner, the one, the square with the arrow on it. So if you select that one, uh, you get a message up whether you want a message or mail but there's also a print option there so I'm going to select print uh, and then you get yeah then you get the printer options up and you can see automatically now because I'm on the same Wi-Fi you can see that the brother printer is already there uh, and um, I'm going to say you've got an option of saying how many copies you want, whether you want it double sided or not, and I'm just going to select print. And that document is now being sent to the printer. The printer will uh, wake up from sleep mode and uh, start printing. You can see if you have a look at the display there, you can see it's now receiving data. and we're printing out. Just going to show you a couple of things back on the uh, iPhone. For example, if I go into my photos uh, and open up a photo like that one there, you s even if it's in a different program, you still have exactly the same menu. Uh, you can then choose to see I've got more options here, but if I go to print a document, You've got the same option there of select the printer and print. And there it is there, my recent printer, and hit print, and away you go. Super easy, just make sure you have the, the printer is connected to the Wi-Fi. If you have any problems or you need to troubleshoot it, the first thing I would check was to actually try to print to the printer from the, uh, through the Wi-Fi from the computer or try to eliminate things that way. And uh, that's it. Thanks for watching.